Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Welcome to Rosie's. Welcome to Rosie's tonight. All right. So come on in and grab a seat. We got a good show tonight. We are selling some Seeds of Hope items. We're going to have our two artists, Linda Fleming and Trudy Mendenhall, in here in just a second. Just want to make sure everything is A-OK -okay on the Facebook pages. Let's make sure before we uh, do anything else, we will make sure that we are up and out here. So I hope everybody is having a good day today, and uh, we are excited to have you here. All right. Looks like we've got both pages up. Okay. Let me go ahead and say good evening to everybody on Facebook. Oh, I spelled it wrong, but that's okay. All right. So John is busy tagging. And um, when you come in, just say hello. And we'll um, have a few, uh, one of the first gals or guys in the house. Let me know how everything is sounding. Uh, we're excited to have our artists in here tonight. They have been working on more Seeds of Hope projects. So hello there. Okay, so um, remember to register on StreamYard so we can see you. Or if you haven't registered on StreamYard, um, uh, we can go ahead and have you, if you bid or claim a prize, just put your name um, minus whatever it is that you're claiming. Hi, Mark. Hi, Debbie. Looks good and sound is good. Awesome. We are excited. I don't think we're going to have, it's not going to be a really big sale tonight, but we have a lot of pieces. We have a lot of pieces that are going to be one of a kinds tonight. Um, and then we're going to um, let you see the bear again in case you missed it the first time. Okay. All right. So without further ado, I am going to bring in um, our artist. I'm just going to say hi to everybody in the room that I can see. I see Mark and I see Deborah. I see Miss Mary. I see Cle uh, Chloe and Deborah. Uh, I see I see lots of people coming in. Say hello and welcome. If you are coming in on YouTube, um, we like our new YouTube family also. Okay, um, let me go back and make sure we're up on Facebook. We are indeed. Okay, I'm going to bring the girls in. We're going to talk about the project and then we're going to put our first items up. So our first artist to come in is Miss Linda Fleming. Hi, <laughs> Hi everybody. Okay. So um, we have Linda, Fl Linda in the house. And um, for those of you that don't know, Linda worked for Fenton Glass and she is a Fenton artist and she works for the co-op now. And she is part of this project. Um, we have worked hard on this together. And here is going to be our second artist, Miss Trudy Mendenhall. There Hello. she is. <laughs> okay. So um, I'm, I think I'm going to do this triple screen here so we can all talk together here. All right. Um, ladies, let me hear if you sound okay. How do, how do you sound, Trudy? I sound good. Okay. <laughs> Linda? Good. All right. Okay. Everybody says hi. There is Cato. Uh -huh. Okay. So we're going to offer some items up tonight, and they are the Seeds of Hope items. We're quickly going to tell the story. If there's somebody that's watching on the Rewind um, and doesn't know the story, we're going to familiarize you, you with it so you understand what this is all about. And um, we collaborate, the three of us, don't we, gals? Yes. We collaborate, we brainstorm, um, and we came up with this idea and. Um, I guess I was feel personally, I was feeling very down watching the news every day and I just could not get out of this funk. And um, it was really debilitating for a couple days. And I started brainstorming with the girls and um, we, we started to think about the sunflower of Ukraine. And we started to think about how beautiful the sunflower stood high above the garden with, in all its majesty with its yellow, beautiful uh, petals, its strong stem and and uh, strong roots to hold it in that ground so tall. And then we started to think about how when the sunflower dies, it loses its seeds and it looks like it's dying and it looks like it's fading, but it's actually we're spreading its uh, beauty all over the countryside, wherever the seeds land. And that's how the three of us are kind of looking at um, the Ukrainian people, that they are strong, vibrant people and that they're just like the sunflower 
they will spread them wherever they land, wherever they are relocated, they will come up just as beautiful as they were um, in Ukraine. Did I say that correctly, ladies? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. And for somehow that makes me deal with it more because I personally, I just think they're going to be fine. They're not going to be fine, obviously now, but they're strong people and they will beautify any place they be, they are. And they're just going to, they're, they're going to get through this eventually. So that's how we're, we're thought of the project. And um, Linda came up with the name Seeds of Hope and 10% um, of the proceeds for this project will go to UNICEF. And um, we thought that that together as a trio, we thought that was a good um, place to donate our um, our funds because we, we feel they really need, the children really need it. There's so many that are orphaned now. So that is our project. That's what we've worked on together. And we're going to show you a few more pieces of it tonight. So um, without further ado here, there, we're going to bring Linda up. Now, Linda... Um, Last week we showed Linda's bear, which was our first, our first piece. And um, mm -hmm. we're going to, I'm going to go over the fact that we sold quite a few bears last week. And um, I have to tell you, most everybody is all taken care of. Uh, very few have not paid yet. So Linda's going to get the sunflower seeds with the bear because every piece of Seeds of Hope has a sunflower packet that goes with it so you can spread the beauty across your own your own yard. So we are we still have we've had people donate bears and if you want another bear they are $75. The people that uh, ordered bears last week should have them in the mail midweek this week. So you should have your bear if you ordered it by this time next week. So um, we're going to put the bear up um, if anybody is looking and did not get one last week. They are $75. And this is the um, Seeds of Hope Bear. So we're gonna run that just in case um, somebody didn't have a chance to get one. Linda, those are so cute. <laughs> Thank you. So um, when you purchase one of these, you get uh, $3 shipping from, um, from Linda on the first class, and you are also getting a package of sunflower seeds. So um, I know so, so many of you are so excited to get one. I think we sold, we almost sold every bear we had last week. We had like 30 orders. So if anybody else is thinking about it and wants one, there you go. We wanted to show you one more time. So say hello if you're in the room. You guys are awful quiet. He's so cute, Linda. <laughs> So describe him a little bit to us, Linda. <clears throat> okay. Um, I put a little bit of blue on his head to, to signify the, the blue sky. The sky will be blue again. And mm -hmm. we put, I put little birds, the little suggestion of birds, nothing too detailed about it, that will be dr dropping the remnants of the seeds that they eat from the sunflowers. Mm -hmm. So the sunflowers hang their heads when they're ready to drop their seed. And so we put a couple open ones and a couple that are dropping their seeds. And then I put the colors of the Ukraine flag on his pads on his feet, yellow and oh, blue. Oh, you know what? I didn't even notice that. I don't think we <laughs> talked about that last week. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah. So we wanted to signify the colors of the UK, the Ukraine flag, yellow and blue. Mm -hmm. So that's what this bear is. Okay. And All right. So we of them to show him. What's that? We have 19 finished. Yes. And we ready have, to go. We have orders for like 20, 27, I think. So um, yeah. We're, and, and we have people that are donating bears. So if you want a bear and you didn't get one last week, um, I must have missed it, Susan. $75 for the bears. If you are watching this on the Rewind and want one or you want to comment on the, in the YouTube comments, again, there's $75 a bear. If you did not get one from the first showing, we just wanted to show you again. Okay, Tammy, let me add you to our list. Tammy Albritton is going to take one. And um, 
I got you, Tammy. Thank you, Tammy. And remember, you will get um, some sunflower seeds right along with your bear in the same box. And um, you can plant those. And any, any of the items tonight, you'll get a sunflower uh, seed packet so you can put them in your garden. And it will remind you of the hope. And this hope is for really any situation. Um, yeah. It is. It can be applied to a lot of situations. Okay. Anybody else want one? Tammy took one. Um, and if you want one, you can claim it now. And the ones that, that are claimed now will probably be two weeks out. But um, the ones from last week, we should have them this by this time next week. Uh, <laughs> Melissa Delgado says they're beautiful. They certainly oh, are. Thank you. I'm not on. I couldn't hear. We, we hear you, Trudy. Oh, you do? <laughs> Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. So Tammy uh, takes one. Anybody else? Um, if you'd like one, just comment below. I know most of you saw it last time we were on, but we just start we start to show while John was um, tagging. And uh, thank you for the help here. Okay. So what's that? <laughs> proceeds. Donations. Yes. Proceeds go to UNICEF. Not a portion of the proceeds go to UNICEF. And um, we all three agreed on that charity, and that's what we are going to do. Um, and we're very excited about that. Um, we actually agreed on that all together. There wasn't much talk about that. <laughs> we just decided that, and it was great. All right. Okay. So now we're going to have um, the praying children. We're going to keep um, Linda up there because we have several praying children, and, and they are also going to be $75, but this is for the set. Um, and some of these are only one of. So we'll we'll tell you what they are. And if you want one, you can go ahead and claim one. So the black pair, there's only one, isn't there? This is green. Oh, green. Okay. Oh, now I see it. Okay. Yeah. There's one set. Yeah, boy and a girl. Okay. And so this is a these are one of a kinds. This one is as of right now. Um, so you can pull them back a little bit, Linda. Okay. Uh, yes, there you go. And um, so these are special too, because the bottom of them, they, they are marked with sunflowers instead of the roses for a group. So this special project has a sunflower on the bottom and mm -hmm. signed by the artist. And these are um, a one of a kind in the green. So we have the green, and let's see the other colors that we have. Amber gold. Okay, and the gold. That is really cute. So let's go ahead and turn them around so we can see all the, the different designs on them. Oh, look at that. This little guy is holding a blue bouquet. Oh, he's holding a blue bouquet. Yeah. Uh, Joel says he's super excited to be a part of two Fenton fine, finest artists. You are right. Thank you, you are right. So uh, these are $75. These colored ones are one of a kind. And then we'll go for the blue ones. Um, aren't they cute? They have the sunflowers and uh, the little blue bouquet in the ends are mm -hmm. behind their back. They're so and they cute. have little faces. Okay. Blue eyes. <laughs> What's a hashtag, Nancy? I don't know what a hashtag is. I don't. <laughs> it's, it's one of these. <laughs> but what, what is it? What purpose does it serve? None, in, none to me. <laughs> I use it for a pound sign. <laughs> oh, okay. So we have the green or the yellow, and what other color do we have? I can't remember. Oh, you had? Didn't you have a blue? Um. In the praying kids, yes. Two sets of these. Okay. And she's got a blue ribbon in her hair. These are the satin. This these you can just we'll just call these crystal satin if you want these in the praying kids. Yeah. And those are crystal satin and they have the bouquet in the back and the roses. Yeah. And then if I get my fingers out of the way, you can see this is the the sunflower that's dropping its seeds. Mm -hmm. And then this one's up nice and tall. Okay. Okay. Same on her. And Right. And these are in the satin crystal. 
And these mm -hmm. are the seeds of hope. Look at the little blue bows in their hairs. And the yellow mm -hmm. picks up the yellow in the flag of the sunflowers. Yep. All right. And so we also have, yeah, okay. And we have, don't we have a light blue one? These two. Okay. These are so pretty. I can't believe it. And we're, I, I don't think we're ever going to find this color again. It is actually the color of the blue flag. It is a very pretty satin blue. It's, mm -hmm. but it's, it, it almost glows. Look at the color there. So these are also $75. And these, this, this pair I'm sure will be a one of a kind. Look at what you did to us <laughs> back there. <laughs> I love that. So those <laughs> those are the light blue um, yep. or blue crystal, however you want to say it. And those are $75 too. All you have to do is claim those. And those are so cute. Um, <laughs> that pair, I know I'll never find another in that shade. Okay. So Mary Hogue is going to take the light blue. Okay. okay. Um, they're just so pretty. Thanks, Mary. Mary Hogan. Okay. That, that'll be number five. Mm -hmm. okay. and um the blue's already gone susan okay did you have another colored one linda well these okay we'll do those in a minute okay um so does anybody want the other ones which we have the yellow and we have the satin uh the the crystal satin And then um, the other color was green. Yeah. And those are $75 and there are two pieces. There are two pieces. I like the green. The green is really pretty. Yeah, it shows up. The yellow shows up nice. Yes. So Mary says they'll represent her grandkids who are part Ukrainian. Great. Yes, that'll be wonderful. And here's this satin. Okay. I lost you guys for a minute. We're, we're not, I'm not getting a very good signal. Oh. Okay. We'll see if it comes back. All right. Hang on just a second. There we go. Okay. All right. Anyone else on those? What we have left is the satin crystal. The, the um, yellow, which is, it, it's a pretty yellow. It's almost like a sunflower yellow. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. That's also one of a kind. And then we have the green, which is one mm -hmm. of a kind. So there's $75. That's the two pieces. So you're getting two pieces for $75. The shipping on these, well, we probably can get it in a first class box. I'm not sure. But these will also come with your sunflower seeds. So um, if you want one of those, just let us know. I think we're going to move on and sell an item auction style, and we will come back to the other praying kids that we have. And um, we're going to bring Miss Trudy in. Hi, Peggy. Hi, Peggy. Okay. So Linda, we'll put Linda over there. And Trudy, let's put up a piece of your blue overlay. Ah. So we have some, some special pieces that are blue overlay. And we're going to put these up auction style because we only have one of them. And this one is, I think they call this a, I don't know if they call this a jug or a pitcher. I think it's a pitcher. Okay. Um, I'll move this up here so you can see the sunflowers better. There are nine, nine panel, panels going around. And it has <laughs> bamboo handle. Um, so there are three, three different sunflowers Nine. that repeat three times around. It won't, <clears throat> and of course it has the sunflower and the signature on the bottom. Plus, here we go with this camera thing again. Um, <laughs> I have 2022 20, on the bottom as well. And I think we need to start this at 15, Heidi. Okay, and what number are we going to put on it? This will be number, I've already numbered the little guy, so this will be number two. Okay. Um, and we're going to call this the um, blue overlay picture. 
And as you can see, it's white on the inside. Okay. So I'm going to put the music on real soft so it helps us. It helps me with the time a little bit. You probably can't see, but there are seeds falling down. Um, <clears throat> two thirds of the sunflowers have started to turn downwards, and they have three curled leaves going downwards. So seeds are dropping from those. Okay, I'm collecting the highest bids. We'll let the music go off, and then we'll talk a little bit more about this piece. Trudy will just show you. Those are the, those are the lives of the sunflower in progression. Hi, Mary Willett. Nice to see you tonight. We have 42 with Sharon, 45 with Donna. Eileen is going to come in at 50. Remember, part of these proceeds will go to UNICEF. And we're so excited to be able to work on this together as a group. It's just really been a nice project. And um, we are at 50 with Eileen. And we're going to tell you a little bit about Blue Overlay. Um, we are repurposing this or, or bringing it back to life. This Blue Overlay, I believe, is from the 60s. Um, and it just makes the perfect backdrop for the... Um, the flag. It's the same color blue and the, the blue with the sunflowers is such a perfect color combination for what we were trying to get across here. So we have um, actually, I'm sorry, 52 with Sharon V. Chloe is at 54. And so it's just really perfect. We, we don't, we do not have a lot of blue overlay pieces. Um, they are hard to come by. So um, if you see a blue overlay piece that you like, you want to bid on it because you may not see it again, depending on what we can find. Um, so this piece is a tall picture. And how, how tall did you say this was, True? But it's not. Uh, got to have my, I would say it's seven to eight inches tall. I don't have my. Um, hmm. Your ruler? ruler? Yeah. You know me, I lose words. Um, I will, I will tell you though, um, what I'm seeing on my screen is a much darker blue. The blue is actually a baby blue or a powder. That tape measures. Yep. It's pretty. Thank you. Okay. We are at 58 and uh, just let us know if you're out. Sharon V is at 59. Here, would you see if you can see the ruler on my table? I'm sending one of my granddaughters to see if she can find a ruler. That's or what I'm looking at my studio right now. It looks like there was an explosion in there. <laughs> I'm in the same predicament here. Oh, my. <laughs> I'm not working on stuff. <laughs> oh, the glassware came and it was all fine. Good. In fact, okay, so Chloe's at 61. Eileen. Joel and Sharon, let us know. Sharon's out. Chloe's at 61. So we're waiting for Eileen and we're waiting for Joel. So there, depending on who you buy from tonight, um, if you buy from Linda, I'll be invoicing for Linda. If you buy from Trudy, Trudy will send you her own invoice and shipping. All right. We're going to do a last chance. It is eight and a half inches tall. You know, though, anybody that is really creative doesn't have things in order. I don't think I don't think those two even merge. If you're creative, you, you you're you always just. Is that true, Linda? It's called chaos. Yes. <laughs> totally agree. Chaos is a good word. That's true. 62 with Eileen. Joel is out. Uh, Chloe, let us know if you're in or out. We're waiting for Chloe, and I'll show you on, our, on your screen that Eileen is our high bid at 62. Uh, Chloe's at 64. I read that somewhere. The more creative the, you are, the more just messy you are. That's how you work. That's how you are. <laughs> <laughs> creative well, individuals are not organized. <laughs> it's probably a reflection of what's going on in my brain. <laughs> When I'm defining, I mean, I wouldn't want to be in there. 
<laughs> okay, so Eileen is out. I still am waiting for Chloe. Yeah, Debbie says, wow, I must be really creative. Yeah. <laughs> Chloe, let us know. I don't see your bid. We're, oh, Chloe's at 64. Okay, then I think we're all set. Okay. <clears throat> okay, Chloe gets it. And that's number two. And that is um, the blue overlay jug. Okay. Ah, jo Joel, you changed your mind and you came in after the sold. Darn. Aww. Well, we could put up another okay. piece and give her a chance. Well, we'll we're going to let Linda come up here and do one. Hey, Linda. Yeah. Hey, Linda. <laughs> You got your, you got your base, you got your basket. Yes. Okay. This is nine and a half inches tall. Yes. So um, we're going to, we're going to put number, um, I'm going to start you with 20 on, on this one. Okay. Okay. So this is not a Fenton basket, but what it is, I think it's a, uh, I think it's West. Is there a mark on the bottom of that, Linda? I think it's, is it Westmoreland? Did you see a maker's mark? No, it just has that design. Okay. Which um, I use this the sun flower. Linda. Okay. This was sent to Linda as a blank and she painted it and she just thought it was wonderful for the seeds of hope. So she's, you see the little blue flowers in there and, um, the, the daisies have transformed into beautiful tall sunflowers. So this is a one of a kind piece. And um, we're just going to call this uh, sunflower basket. And this is from our Seeds of Hope line. And we're going to have you start it out wherever you want to. It is beautiful. Yes. This is so pretty. Um, I believe this is Westmoreland, but I'm not, I'm not quite sure. Um, but it is a big, heavy basket, nine and a half inches tall. <clears throat> Are we just going to start this out, Linda? Whatever you think. We didn't really talk about that. No, whatever you think. It has a nice texture to the white, too, and it appears to be uh, like a satinized piece. Yes. It's beautiful. Another one that has been repurposed, and um, this, this glass is vintage. It's probably from the 60s or 70s, and we've painted the sunflowers on it for hope. It's just a wonderful, it's a wonderful message, and it like like I said, it applies to a lot of a lot of different circumstances. If you know somebody that that needs a little boost, look at the blue flowers on there. Oh, it's gorgeous! It was fun to okay, do. Okay, so we'll start it out at 20 and go from there. And we know there's a lag. All right, here comes silver. It's paint brushes in it. Yeah. <laughs> when I saw this piece, I thought of you right away. It's so it's so pretty. And I knew you could just dress that up. Whenever they so this it was fun to do, really. John likes it apparently. <laughs> <laughs> so this will come with a also with your sunflower seeds, everything that we sell tonight is going to come with some sunflower seeds so that you can um, spread those seeds in your yard or wherever and, and uh, keep that feeling going. John's in at 35. He's, he hadn't seen this piece. Oh, He must have fell in love with it. I've never seen him. Bit <laughs> Tom said I should have put my paintbrushes in it. <laughs> mm -hmm. I had... Was Make sure it. you watch the screen. The bid is on the left-hand side of your screen. I was wishing I had gotten some silk sunflowers for some of my vases. That would have been pretty. Yeah. And they'd be pretty in that basket, too. Yeah. They would be. Put some on this side and some on this side. Yes. Yes. And we're going to continue with this project um, as we get pieces probably once a month we'll have we'll have pieces on it because it's it's just such a wonderful message we're gonna we're gonna have another um, glass pet that that will be like the bear that we will do um, that will match the bear and we're thinking maybe the long tail bird next thirty eight dollars with Jill so there's a lot of people bidding so I'm gonna let you guys uh, tell me if you're in or out. 
how long will you be offering the Seeds of Hope collection? And are you looking for any specific pieces for us to send you? Um, if you have blue overlay pieces, yes. Um, we are we're <clears throat> thinking about working on a long tail bird next in crystal um, or blue satin. Mm -hmm. So um, we have those pieces that we're looking for. $38 for Jill. Remember, 10% of this will go um, to the charity. Okay, Tammy is at 40. Those flowers just pop right out and they're raised too, Linda. Mm -hmm. um, you might not see that, but but those flowers are raised. So that's why they really come to life. They're, it's not a flat painting. It is actually a raised flower. Yeah, it's um, and the, the color it's that you put. And some of the flowers are yellow and some of them you've kind of loaded your brush with a little orange and then mm -hmm. it's really pretty. Okay, Tammy is at 40. Tammy's at 40, so let us know if you're in or out. A friend of mine plants um, sunflowers every year and she always has this bright orange in amongst all the yellows and I just love it, so that's why I did it. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to do a last chance. Yeah, Jan does it. And it looks like everybody is out and Tammy is at 40. So I'm just going to make sure um, if you are considering, and I'm going to say this because I we Joel missed out the last time, bid what you want to bid during that music and then just keep your fingers crossed afterwards because it's hard to see everybody. I do my best. Um Okay, so John is in it. Or John is out. Uh, Jill's out. Everybody's out except for Tammy. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and we are going to sell it. All right. Okay. okay. <clears throat> so I'll write that down. Tammy. And that's Tammy <laughs> Albritton. Tammy Albritton. <clears throat> Thank you, Tammy. Yeah, thank you. And she gets um, the daisy basket. Okay. All right. So we're going to go back to uh, Miss Trudy Mendenhall. And she is going to have number three. And um, let's do another blue overlay lay piece, Trudy. Okay. Somebody who bid on the last one missed out. So I'm going to put this one up. Now, this little vase is it's the same pattern sequence as on the last piece you saw uh this one is i just get my ruler upside down this one is five and a half inches tall it's a little bit big or bigger around than the other one it's four and a half inches in diameter across here and of course it's white on the inside which is mm. hard to tell and it's a baby blue and we'll start it at um, $20. Okay. So this is the beat, This is the melon style vase. Um, and this is the blue overlay. This is a vintage piece of Fenton glass from the 60s. It has the ring around the top and it has the melon style vase. And what's so beautiful about this is it has the stages of the sunflower's life all the way around. And it's just so pretty. And um, we're going to go ahead and start taking bids here. Um, of course, this is the melon style vase, which is so popular right now. Um, and the um, there you go. On the bottom, instead of our normal rose as a signature for this piece, we have sunflowers on the bottom. And we all felt that this blue overlay was the best backdrop for um, our designs. So it's just gorgeous. Having it we sitting have... here in the light, here on this edge and around the bottom, you can actually see the color of blue they used in the overlay. It's kind of like a little darker blue band and a darker blue band on the bottom. So the overlay was transparent blue over white. I can see it from here. Yeah. Isn't that neat? Mm hmm It is. Hmm? Chloe's in at 40. 
just remember if you're bidding from different platforms, I'm putting the first one in. Um, a lot of these pieces are the only ones that we have right now. Um, and it may be the only ones we ever have because um, we're not going to run this project forever. We'll probably run it through the summer through Marietta. Um, and it just depends how much blue overlay we can come across. So um, you, know, you might not ever see this particular piece again. Um, so let's, uh, let's be aware of that, but it is a case glass. It's an overlay. So it's, it's like cased in blue crystal, really pretty. Mm -hmm. If I see how, I, yeah, there you go. You can really tell it on the camera. And then there's, you can really see it on the bottom as well. Of course, you've got this person here that, um, hmm, that uh, gets her hand backwards when showing it <laughs> close up. <laughs> okay, so Christine Smith is in at 50. Wendy is out. Christine Smith is in at 50, waiting for Chloe. Joel's at 55. And, and again, these, this piece will come with your sunflower seeds. And uh, if, if Trudy is selling, she will invoice you. And yeah. if Linda is, is selling, I will invoice you. So that's, that's how we roll. And things are, every, everything is going at a pretty good rate. All the bears from last week, um, the first bunch of them anyway, should be done and in your hands probably this time next week. So uh, if, we're right on schedule. If we have a new person, for example, from um, YouTube, mm -hmm. um, Heidi will flash my, you can find me on, let's see. You can find me on Facebook, on Messenger. You can send me a message so I know mm -hmm. how to get your invoice to you. Or you can send me an email. And Heidi has my email and she can put it on the screen. So either right. way, we can reach you. Yep. Okay, Joel is at 60. Chloe, you are out and so is Christine. $60 is bid. And our... our um, Charity of choice is UNICEF and it's going to, we're, we're going to stay with UNICEF through the whole project. Okay. So Joel is at 60. Chloe's at 62. Christine is out. Thanks Christine for what you did do. You know what we should do? I'm going to make a little master list. If we ever get another one of these, um, <laughs> which I don't know if we will. I'm going to write Christine down and I'm going to write uh, anybody else down that we might need that for. Okay. So Chloe's at 62. Joel, you let us know what you want to do. Um, we've already done the last chance. So Chloe's at 62. We're waiting for Joel. And I think that's it. Joel's at 65. So he's still actively bidding. John says, true to your true treasure, my friend. He loves your work. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Joel's at 65. Chloe, let us know. He's oh, we still have active bidding. So we'll wait till one of you guys say that you're out. Um, Chloe's at 67, waiting for Joel. I don't know about Linda, but I thoroughly enjoy painting the sunflowers. They are fun. Mm -hmm. Because when you're painting them, you're letting the petals dance. I call it dancing around the center. Um, uh -huh. So I always had this little tune going in my head. So I get that particular flower done and then move to the next. <laughs> I know. Well, I, know. I posted a video of Linda doing her sunflowers on YouTube today. So um, if you want to see the work in progress. There's a little seed dripping down. Doing her thing. Okay. All right, Trudy. My table cleared. Okay. okay. so that is sold to Chloe. And Thank she you gets guys. Um, number three, which is the um, melon pitcher. Okay. Yes. Trudy Thank you, guys. She's already seen the video. Did you see your video, Linda? Yes. I watched it today while I was painting. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> All right. Thank you, Chloe. We appreciate that. Okay, we're going to bring Linda up. And um, Linda, do you have, um, you? I can't remember, do you have choice animal left or? Yeah, two. Okay, so we're going to do choice of, we have two glass pets in the Seeds of Hope. So this is going to be number number 21 for Linda. This is a sitting cat. And a happiness bird, the long tail. Okay. Meow, that has to be crazy cat lady. <laughs> <laughs> so um, you, we have the kitty cat. L look at the sunflowers, the detail in the sunflowers. Um, on the blue, You'll, this, you'll get your um, donation and you'll also get your pack of sunflower seeds. And we do have the cat and the bird in this choice. You'll get one or the two, the long tail bird or the cat. This is in the older blue satin pieces from the 60s. So we are revamping them and bringing them back to life. So we only have one of each of these. So be the bitter. And we have 25. And so here we go. Shows up good on this color. It yeah. looks wonderful on that color. Mm -hmm. And if you want to consider donating some pieces to the project, just email me and we'll see what you have. Um, we are we're going through whatever we can find right now. So 32 with Susan Perry. 45 with Chris, Casey, crazy cat lady. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't get it out. I know. <laughs> I wanted to help you, but I didn't know what you were trying to say. <laughs> <laughs> okay, crazy cat ladies in at 45. Now remember, if you buy a single animal, um, it's only going to be uh, for for Linda, three it, first class shipping in a first class shipping box for an animal is we charge $3. So um, it's a great deal. You're going to get your sunflower packet and you're going to um, get your your little um, seeds of hope animal. Okay, Joel, is it 50? Will this fit in one of those boxes? Yes, it does. Oh, good. But, t well, we're, we're going to talk here, girl to girl here. So you guys are just listening. If you take the bird and put it on a piece of bubble wrap and then put it, lay it down sideways and then put another piece of bubble on top you know, like tear it off a little bit and not roll it. It'll fit in there. Perfect. Those, those okay. boxes are pretty indestru indestructible. Okay. <laughs> They're um, supposed to be non-crushable, so it should be fine. Cool. I would, I would wrap the beak. I would, I yeah. would, I, I'd wrap the beak and tape the bubble right around the beak. Cause that's, that is the most delicate part of the bird and mm -hmm. it's, and it's yes. tail. Okay. Crazy mm -hmm. cat ladies in at 55. And we're waiting for uh, Joel's in at 60. There you go. Okay, 60 with Joel. We are really wanting to focus on blue um, and the crystals and um, the, um, the, 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 blue satin and the blue overlay and the crystal. That's what we're focusing on. We got a few in other colors, but we are looking for those. And we're, we really want to do a project where we do the um, long tail birds, where we make them like snowbirds, like we do with the bears. And so we're looking for crystal long tail birds or short tail birds. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so crazy cat ladies and at 65, let us know if you're in or out. 65 is our high bid. We're needing to hear from Susan Perry and Joel. Susan Perry and Joel. Bitter will get choice. Joel's at 70. Joel's at 70. Susan and Crazy Cat Lady are both out. Beautiful. It really shows up good on blue satin. Mm hmm Okay, Susan is out. Joel's at 66, waiting on Crazy Cat Lady. She is in at 75. Now we're waiting for Joel. All 
Okay. Do you like holding the, the animal up there close like that, Linda, compared to having it on a turntable? Mm -hmm. It's mm -hmm. a little different. Yeah. <laughs> I go with the turntable. <laughs> well, yeah, if I had I like to do to hold it up. I like, now, now that I'm doing it, I like to hold it up. But John tells me, we have to have a turntable, too. We have to get techie and have two cameras. All right, 78. We still have active bidding. Joel's in at 78. Remember, bidder will get the choice, and then the backup get, bidder will get second choice. Okay, we still have active bidding at 80. I didn't have room to write hand painted, so I just put my name. <laughs> That's good. That's all we need. Okay, Joel, in or out? Sunflower takes up more room than a rose. <laughs> $80 is bid with Crazy Cat Lady. Whoops. This is so oh. smooth. I know. Sat satin glass is really satin glass. I mean, when you touch mm -hmm. it, it is smooth and soft. Yeah, it's because it's acid etched. It's yeah. not black. <laughs> they did acid, acid etched. etched. Uh -huh. Acid etched stuff's wonderful. What's involved in that? Do they dip it in something? Yeah, yeah. and it's out. It's outlawed now. <laughs> it's very dangerous. Uh, the fumes—they look like spacemen back there in no. the room where they did that. But it, it under the stairs. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, it's under the stairs. stairs. Really. Oh, yeah, the fumes I, are the fumes are deadly. I, I mean, you just can't be anywhere near it. That's what's wrong with us. <laughs> Maybe that's what's wrong with us, Linda. There's an <laughs> echo. Too many fumes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we're waiting for Joel. Let us know. That explains a lot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to give you about 15 seconds. We got to we got to move on. Joel, in or out? In or out? In or out? Okay, you'll be the backup. We pretty much know what CC what Crazy Cat Lady wants. Um, let Tammy, me, let me you guess. Like the cat? <laughs> Tangled. I'm sure she does, but we just want to verify that. Um, Tammy, which one would you like? You can have them both if you want. She takes the cat. And Joel, is that the one that you wanted? We still have the long-tailed bird. Yeah, please. <laughs> we have the long-tailed bird if Joel would like it. I think so. I swear I just heard a cat. Did, did I just hear your cat, Linda? Yes, <laughs> because Echo's pestering her. Mine are miracle. Fighting. It's a miracle. <laughs> okay, and Joel is going to take the bird. Thank you, Joel. Okay. All right, we're going to go back Thank to Thank you, Trudy. cat lady. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Hi. Trudy, number four for you. Well, if anybody else wants long-tailed birds, I have two. Okay. You know, um, mine are painted differently, but they're still the same color. The acid etch. The acid etch. Okay. And so, uh, let's put. Should we just put yours up for the same price? Well, that's what I was thinking. It would just make it simpler. They're two. They're okay. just alike. Um, they're twins. They're twins. <laughs> Linda and I each have our own style of painting. You do. Um, so so Tr Trudy's birds will offer for the same price. Um, yes. If you want those, and um, she her son, she's done hers with a little bit larger sunflowers. Let's see them a little bit closer up there, Trudy. 
Um, and they'll, they'll be the same price. They're just a, um, a set price. And we'll, we'll go with what the last item went for, which was $85. Um, and Trudy has a little bit larger sunflower. Um, very pretty on the same blue satin glass from the 60s. Um, and so there you go. If you would like one of those, so pretty. Oh, look at she's got seeds coming down from the flowers. Yes. Um, uh, Diane, to get your these 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 are already done. So as soon as they're invoiced, they'll be sent out. Oh yeah. With Linda, I invoice her, and it takes just a little bit longer. But she she is such a quick packer. She's ready to go too as soon as we get everything in. So everything tomorrow. All right. We're, so we're, it, we will invoice tomorrow. Okay. Okay. And then as soon as we get the seeds, then we'll ship as soon as they're paid for. All right. Okay. So there's any? only two of these. These are on the blue satin glass, and this is from the 60s. If you want to claim one, these are 85. You you notice the sunflower on these is very large, and, and uh, Trudy's put her own little um, style to it. She's got the bigger flowers, and you can see the sunflowers falling off the um, actual sunflower. Um, the the seeds. Okay, fine. great. <laughs> Sunflower seeds. Yeah, I'm. I'm watching. If you've already paid, Diane, and let me make sure. Um, from, did you get a bear? Because I don't recognize your name. Okay. All right. Any interest in those? One more time, we'll do it. These are number four, weren't they? Four A and four B. I think it's on four B. They are so cute. We'll give you just a second to look at them. And if you don't pick them up during the sale today, you can get them on the rewind or you can put in the comments that you'd like one on YouTube and we'll have these birds available. Okay. Put these back here. To join okay, me. Trudy, let's put up um, another one, your overlay big bowl. How's that? Oh, that will work. Okay. Here we go. Now Ooh. again, <laughs> pretty. Thank you. Uh, what? I like it. I have such a hard time with the camera lens. Yeah, me too. Right place, Heidi. Yes, it looks beautiful. Okay. Looks good. So th this is, again, the vintage blue overlay glass from the 60s. It might even be from the 50s. I never really checked the date. Okay, I, so I, here we go on this one. So do you need a starting price, or do we have one already? They're already going. All yeah. right. It's number five. <laughs> again, it has the sunflower on the bottom. And this is not the rose bowl. This is the bigger bowl. Oh yeah. This, this is one, this one is um five to five and a half inches tall. And across the widest point of the bowl at six and a half inches. So it, it's good size, which you can tell okay. from and so explain to us the reasoning for the sunflower seeds. Is there a progression, or the sunflowers, is there a progression as we go around? Yes. You'll have the big sunflower wide open. You'll have two of those. So there's six of those all together. And then you have the ones that have the petals starting to fold over. Those mm -hmm. are the ones where the seeds are falling. Nice. Okay. I think I can, mm -hmm. I can see them or not. A little bit. Yep. So it's a it's kind of a progression thing. Some are full, fully open. Um, my centers have two colors of brown, a touch of green, and um, a touch of a really, really light brown. Uh, where the seeds are starting to dry out, mm -hmm. warm and dry out. So, um, anyway, uh, nobody yet. Okay, so Joel is at 60. Mm. 
This one is number five. That's my neck. Crack, crack, crack. All right, we have 65 with Mary Hogue. She just beat you, Susan. And 65 is with Mary. So it's just amazing what the sunflowers do to the blue overlay pieces. They just they just bring them to life. And it's it's such a wonderful message. And, and it's such a wonderful canvas for what we're doing. Um, and this is the big melon vase. This is the big uh, bowl. It's bigger than a rose bowl. But it does have the melon vase base. And you can see it for the tubers that aren't real familiar with it. Um, you can see the melon. It looks like a melon. Mm -hmm. That's why they call it that. It's shaped just like a melon. Yes. Okay, so Joel's at 70. Susan is out. So now we're between Joel and Mary Hogue. So Mary, let us know. Joel is at 70, and we're waiting for Mary. Mary's at 72. It's really cool because both of our artists do have different styles and they both are able to be not only the artist on the piece, but the decorate or but the designer. So they are the designer and the artist. And when they worked for Fenton, they were mainly uh, they were mainly artists. They weren't um, given the ability to design very seldom. Um, and so it's really cool that all these pieces are designed by them also. So they're all a little different. They, they both have their different styles and they're just beautiful. Joel is at 75. So we'll wait for Mary. We will wait for Mary. <laughs> Turned out so nice, You're Trudy. Thank you. Okay, it is sold to Joel for $75. And Joel now, gets that one. I do have another one for the backup bidder if they want it. Okay. Uh, 75 for Joel. Mary, um, it just so happens that we have another one, um, which is very cool if you would like one. Would you like one too, Mary? It's it would be a it would be our pleasure for you to take one so that you could have one too. Um, if you would like one, it, you are the yes, please. Okay. Okay. And Mary takes the big one, the second one. Okay. Thank you very much, guys. Yes, and thank you, bidders. Okay. Everybody. And, um, we'll see. Linda, what, what do you have left? I can't remember. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, um, Trudy, I yeah. you I will send you Joel's email. I have it. He's a okay. Good that would be great. Okay, so we're gonna go with 22 for Linda, and she's got an old piece too in blue overlay, and she's got a melon. That she's got a melon vase now. Is that yeah? That's a little JIP vase. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna do that. We're gonna do the overlay. Okay. So this one was how tall again? Let me measure, Let me measure again. It's eight, so it's a little shorter than Trudy's. Okay. But yours is, a, um, Linda's got the, the mini, it's a kind of a, a, a little JIP. It's got a little turn up mm -hmm. thing in the bloom on top. And right. the melon to this one is a lot thinner and drawn. So it makes it a pretty tall vase. Mm -hmm. um, let's pull it back a little bit so they can see the shape of it. Bring it back by your shoulders. There you go. There it is. This one is taller and we'll have Tom measure it or Linda measure it and show you the height of it. But it has that little JIP twist on the top bloom there and it's just gorgeous and this again is the blue overlay from the 60s or 50s it's 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 antique fenton as it is with the glass and mm -hmm. there is the sunflowers mm -hmm. okay it's eight inches on the jip end okay okay so this kind this comes down yes it's so the front 
what I did in the front was I put the sunflowers while they're tall and, and proud. And then okay, the, so you had them kind of descend. Yeah, and then as you get around to the back, they start to drop a little. And that's where I added the birds and the seeds. Uh huh. You can see the seeds are tiny. And then on the ground is regrowth. There you go. So Christine's so, at 30. Early in the sunflower, looking like that. Yep. And then in, later in the sunflower, as the season goes on, they look like this. Hmm. With the seeds dropping down to cause new sprouts. Yes. Okay. Um, Joel, they are very talented. You ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 38 for Susan Perry. Probably best on this side. Susan Perry is at 38. And I'm, I'm just so... The the girls, I'm just so proud of them. They took the, they took the idea and ran with it and dropped everything they were doing to work on this. And um, it's really a, been a wonderful project. Forty two dollars for Christine. We have forty five with Libby. Okay, so Libby is at forty five. I see a lot of 45s, but I took uh, Wendy first. So Jill and Susan, you're going to have to go higher. Remember, too, we're on both Facebook pages. So if you're on the one Facebook page and you don't see the other gal bidding, just check the screen because I put it on the deals and the Fenton page tonight. 46 with Susan Perry. Can you see that right there? Yeah. Yes. That's, that's my representation of the Ukraine flag. Just the color. Okay, so there's there's just a little spot on there that shows that where the flag is. Yeah. So that you, just, it'll it'll remind you what it is. There you I go. I just wanted to represent their flag. So yes. it's, it's it's just two strokes: one blue, one yellow. One's one direction, and one's the other direction, so that they kind of meshed. Oh, that is a neat idea. So Jill's at forty-seven. Susan, let us know, and Libby, let us know. Uh, Libby is out. And we're waiting for Susan Perry. Uh, Christine Smith is still in the ball game at 50. Did you hear me? Did you hear that pop go? <laughs> no, that I was didn't a pretty hear that. aggressive gulp. <laughs> oh, Tom heard it. <laughs> He's got better hearing okay, than me. <laughs> <is, you know, laughs> it surprised me. Um, Joel is at 55. Susan is out. Okay, so let me let me take a look back and and we'll we'll see that Joel is at 55. Susan's out, Jill is out and we're waiting for Christine Smith. That's as far back as I'm going right now. So we'll do a last chance. See that throat? Yes. That would hold a lot of daffodils. <laughs> yes. And it's small enough that it'll keep them up there so pretty. You know, it's yeah. tight enough that it'll keep those stems in there so it would make such a wonderful bouquet yes i had daffodils all over the kitchen last week and as they started to to fall apart i started throwing them in the trash but i could still go out and pick tons they don't freeze <laughs> okay i see joel at 55 i'm i'm seeing everybody as being out i'm going to give you just a second there's a daffodil it's a little short <laughs> I cut these off today trying to extend their life and I put them in a shorter little piece of pottery and that's why uh -huh. they're so short. But <laughs> they represent much, much more <laughs> as do these right. two little swipes of color. <laughs> yes. Okay. Joel gets that one for 55. Thank you, Joel. Thank you, Joel. I would send you these flowers, but they're kind of on their way out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Trudy, what you got? Oh my. Uh, you know what? 
I have this little basket. It's not fired, but you can sure see what it looks like. I'm going to fire it tomorrow. Ooh. It is blue overlay. And you really get a good picture of what color blue that went over the white because the handle is just yeah. the clear blue, the transparent. And Pretty of course, high. I'm going to hold this up. Um, as you can see, the yellows don't change much when it's fired. Some colors change a lot. Mm -hmm. I'm going to start this one out at 25. I was so anxious to paint this little basket. I had another one, but it shattered. <laughs> oh. That wasn't any fun. Oh, no. It, was it in the kiln? Yeah. Uh, no, it was sitting on the edge of the kiln. Uh, it had already cooled down, and I'm painting. And because um, I had pre fired it, you know how we do? Yep. And I heard ping, and I'm like, oh, no. Oh, <laughs> I looked over, and that was the end of that basket. And then I had this beautiful uh, pitcher, melon pitcher, and it did the same thing, only it shattered into a gazillion pieces. It was just so weird. Um, of course, that's not going to happen with what you're getting. Oh. If that was going to happen, it would have already happened. Um, so you can hear that the handle's good. Okay, Libby's at 50. I like the bamboo handle. I do, too. I do, too. Mm -hmm. Show us the close-up of the flowers again, Trude. Sure enough. As you know, you're not really supposed to pick this up by the handle, which I'm very guilty of. Right. There you go. It's the best place to put your hand. I know. <laughs> So usually when I'm painting them, um, I, I, I pick it up this way. Yeah, me too. Um, and of course on the side to pick it up differently. Yeah. But there's four there are four sets of the same flower pattern going all the way around mm -hmm. the the mm -hmm. entire piece. Yeah. And then the last side. And then, Holding on to um, the stamp is easy. I'm sorry, what? Holding on to the stamp helps me hold it. The, yes. the handle stamp, yeah. Um, I love the I love the handle. I love the color of the handle. I do too. Oh, I do too. And you can see again down on the base. You can see that blue again. Yes, so pretty. And I, I love the way that um, works out. Yes. Okay. So uh, Libby's out and we have $56 bid with Jill. We're going to do a last chance and I'm going to remind you where we're at. And it looks like we need to hear from Christine and Joel. Joel is in at 60. Joel's in at 60. Um, Jill is out. Christine is out. I think everybody is out. All right. So uh, last chance. Joel is in at 60. Uh, this is the blue overlay basket. Number six. I love the blue and yellow. Yes, it's just the it's the perfect canvas for what we're doing and it's just it's just wonderful. We love it too. Okay, I think everybody is out. I'm hoping they're out. I'm going to go ahead and sell it and I sold it to Joel for $60. Okay. Well, thank you guys. Okay. I and think Linda's in the same action. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, Linda, what you got left? I can't remember. Oh, 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 oh you just got you guys just keep coming up with better things. Okay. <laughs> so this one is gonna be your number 23. 23. And this one is a heart nappy, and it's on blue slag or blue heaven. 
I forgot, I forgot we had pieces of this. This is the same color blue, but it's a slag glass and it is fat. Mm -hmm. And Linda's put her little flag on the back. Um, and this is a heart nappy. My name's there, but it's in white. It is there. <laughs> okay, and we'll start this one out. And uh, I forgot about this piece. That is lovely. That is just lovely. So, so this Thank piece you. has hobnail, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. This one's got yeah. hobnail on the outside. Yes, yes. I think and it's if you gorgeous. Look at the bottom, let's see the bottom once again. The bottom has like almost like a bullseye. See how it, the, the swirling goes all the way around? Mm -hmm. um, I call it Blue Heaven, but I'm sure there's a, Fenton has another name for it. <laughs> okay, here we go. We're off to the races. <clears throat> so on this one, I put a lot of birds in the sky because it looked like they belong there. Yeah. And then, and then I put some little seeds falling from the sunflowers. They're very light. I just did them with my pen point. So they're very light. And then regrowth at the bottom. So all, There's a all lot the of work in these pieces. Yeah. 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 And to I did show the different stages. Oh. Pardon me, Linda? I, said I did put a little bit of that orangey color. Mm -hmm. Right. On, on these two. Or these yep. two. Yeah. Okay. And there's a lot of work in these pieces to show the stage of each flower. So um, you can see the design is quite, it's quite wonderful. Thank we you. should send one to President Zelensky. <laughs> Maybe after it's all over with. Yeah. He's got his hands full right now. Also. Mary is in at 65. I'm sure he would like the sentiment though. I'm sure he would. Oh, yes. Uh, Mary's at 65. Jamie's at 67. Debbie is at 70. Here's the side. You can see that white going through. Yes. Mm -hmm. And it's crimped quite tightly, too. It's it's mm -hmm. really got a nice shape to it. It does. I love that. And the fact that it's yeah. shaped like a heart makes it even more special. Yeah. There's the little curly Q. Finger fits through there. The birds fit so well. Yes. <laughs> you like the birds in the sky? Yeah, they've got their own sky. Yeah, they do. That's Tom, by the way. <laughs> Hi, Tom. Hi, Rosie. <laughs> Debbie's at 80. Really is Debbie cool. is at $80. Joel is out. Mary is out. Joel's out temporarily. We really don't know if he's out for sure. But Debbie is at 80. Yes, once the fighting's over and they can return home, and I'm I'm sure they they will. Joel is at 85. So we're waiting for Debbie. Wow, that's just lovely. Okay, Joel's at 85, and Debbie, let us know if you're in or out. And we're just waiting on Debbie. I do not see Miss Harper. There you go. You can see that really well right there. And the size, the size you can tell too. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Just just waiting on Debbie and then we'll move on. We'll see what she wants to do. Um, um, Susan wants to know if you put the flags on the bears. I don't think you did on the bears. You, you, you did the paw prints on the bears. Yeah. I did the representation on the paw. Yellow yes. and yeah. Yellow and blue. Okay. I didn't realize I put it on both sides of this one. Mm -hmm. Okay, Joel got it. Boy, is he doing good tonight. <laughs> Thanks, Joel. Okay. Thank you, Joel, and thank you, um, Debbie, for what you did do. We appreciate all the bidders. Yes, and thank like you, said, we'll, 
as the spring and summer goes on, we'll try to do a sale once a month with this, with whatever we can get in. And um, we'll, we'll see if we can't help you add to your collection. Okay, Miss Trudy, you've got some little top hats, don't you? I do. And there are two. And the only difference is, as you can see, are the tops. One's a tight okay. crimp and one's a... a oh. uh, okay. And they have the same design going all the way around. So they have the same amount of work. I'm going to show... I'll show you each one. Uh, get there closer. I can't see me when I do that or the screen, but I'll turn this around. Looks good. Thank you. So these are both in that blue overlay, and these are both vintage glass, and they are both Fenton. So you can see the difference in the crimps. Mm -hmm. Which way do I want to go here? And these are little top hats. <laughs> uh, yes. They're so, so one cute. Has Let's start like them at 15. Um, okay. One has kind of like a rolled crimp. I don't know how you would explain it. How would you explain it, Trudy? One, one's got kind of a, a rolled crimp, and the other one is 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 a is a crimp that's more upward. That's how we'll explain it. <laughs> yeah. So you got this was a very tight crimp, and this is a very loose one. Okay, there you um, go. Actually, this is a double crimp, and of course, it does stand up. And on this one, they curl down. Okay. All right. Mary's at twenty. Bitter will get choice. Uh, Donna Taylor comes in at 30. And happy birthday, Donna Taylor. Happy birthday oh, to happy you. Birthday. <clears throat> happy birthday. It was Wendy's birthday here recently, wasn't it? Yesterday. Yesterday. Happy, happy birthday again. Yeah. And John's birthday is going to be on the 5th. All right. So he's happy got a birthday, birthday coming John. Up. So how All old right. will John be? How old will he be? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Five <clears throat> years older than me. <laughs> He's still young. Good answer. He's still younger than I am. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we have Susan Perry in at thirty-six. This is for choice. Mary Hogue gets comes in at forty. Hmm. He's still spring chicken in my summer. Yeah, I tried to get him to go to the movies with me on his birthday, and he doesn't want to go. Oh, wow. I'm going to work a little bit harder on him. I was going to say, there's some good ones that are coming out. Yeah. I know, and we haven't been to the movies since before COVID. Mm. I mean, we used to go every Tuesday night. So I'm going to work too. on it. <laughs> you too? Yes. Before the pandemic, because Tuesday night was a discount for our for seniors. <laughs> oh my gosh, we're all in the same wavelength. Yes, us too. Yeah, it's like five dollar movie night. Yeah, or something. Yeah. <laughs> Mary's at forty five. You know what's coming on April fifteenth? Other than taxes, <laughs> no. Uh, the new the new Grindelwald move, movie number three with Dumbledore. Oh yay! Yay! Oh my god! Jared and, and Crystal are going with us. <laughs> uh, Candy said thank you ladies for dedicating your talent and time to help others well you're you welcome know, <laughs> yeah. yes and, and you know it, this is a way of all of us dealing with this and, and, and feeling like there's something that we can do towards it mm -hmm. um, so we're, we're really we're really having a good time with doing it and it's we're enjoying every minute of it okay Mary is at 48, Susan is out. I'm going to do a last chance. Was either paint oh. stuff or fret, right? Yeah. Paint so Mary said one sandwich fret. shop calls it a wisdom <laughs> discount, not a senior <laughs> discount. <laughs> I like That's it. What it should be. I like it. Yeah. All, All right. Work. So our winner is Mary Hogue. So, Mary, you let us know which one you'd like, and Susan is the backup. Mary's will be 7A. 
Oh, sorry about that, uh, Sharon. You missed it. Okay. Got to bid a little quicker. If you come in and you just you just come in bidding like that and you haven't been active, sometimes I miss you. It happens. Um, uh, so Mary wants the low pie crimp. Okay. And that is number 7A. And this one will be 7B. Susan Perry, you are the backup if you want the, the other one. Susan Perry's the backup if she wants the taller one. <coughs> so we'll wait and see what Susan Perry wants to do. And then if she doesn't want it, we'll offer it up, but we'll see what she says. Um, okay. So um, Sharon, would you like, would you like the other one here, Sharon V? I think. Let's see. Let me let me take a look. It's up for grabs, but Sharon missed out. So she wants this one. Um, it might work out for you, Sharon. Just claim it. Okay. Joe. Uh, Sharon got it. Okay. Yep. Uh, Sharon got it. Um, because I missed her bid, Jill. We'll see if we can't find another some more hats. We might come across some more hats. I'm gonna put Jill. Um, I'm gonna put Jill up if we find any more hats, so we'll contact her about it. I might have Thanks, another Sharon. hat. Sorry about that one. Okay, so Jill Gip, let me let me go ahead. Jill, I have your information, don't I? Um, just remind me that I do. I think I do. Oh, oh, I contact you on a messenger too. I know I do. Okay. Um, the high crimp. I got gotcha, you, Jill. And Sharon is the one that we'll look for another hat for. Um, I'm trying to think if I've got one. You, you girls have another hat? I don't know. I don't. Um, I'm all out of hats. Mm -hmm. In fact, I'll, I'll take fact, a look I'm and see all out of blue. blue. <laughs> okay. So what you got, Linda? We What do we got left? A uh, couple icebergs and this. And the, the blue children. Okay. So we both have a Victorian Rose Bowls painted. Um, Trudy, do you have yours available too? Yeah, right here. I have... I'm, I'm going to hold these up so you can see the cramp. Whoops. Okay. Well, let me put you on the, let me put us on the screen here so that we can see. Okay. Um, you're going to so, have your choice of three of these. Hello. There's a tight crimp <laughs> okay. like Linda's. And then there's a loose crimp. You guys are squeezing me. Oh. <laughs> Get her with the balls. <laughs> We can put okay. bows on our ears. <laughs> <laughs> I want to get to see what um, it looks like. <laughs> yes. So these are not satin glass. These are beautiful blue satin Victorian era rose bowls from the 1800s, the late 1800s. So um, Linda has one that is a little lighter shade of blue than Trudy's, and Trudy has two of them. So we're going to do choice. And this, um, I'm just going to put um, Rose Bowl on this. We'll, we'll give it numbers depending on which one sells, okay? Um, we're going to go ahead and start them at 20. And you're going to get your choice of Trudy's or Linda's. So, and I, I wish I could disappear from here, but I can't. <laughs> we tried it earlier. <laughs> I might be able to move Linda over here. I think I can do that. Oh, there we go. Now we'll squeeze Linda. Okay, so those are the Rose Bowls. And these are beautiful 18, they're, they're, um, they, they're Victorian era glass. They've already been fired. And um, you, you guys fi fire them twice, don't you? Not this one. Not this one? Okay. So Not this one. At least 
the at blue least overlay. Yeah. Well, they. It's amazing that they can take a, a refiring after all those years, but it's it's really beautiful mm. glass and it's got a smooth satiny finish. And we're yeah. gonna start them at twenty, and you'll get choice. Yeah, if you're having trouble with the lag, make sure that you are in live chat, not top chat. Here we go. Um, you're going to get at least one. And this glass actually came from the estate in Medina that was from the glass house. So mm -hmm. he collected rose bowls, and um, we thought it was a perfect background for this project. And these are on satin glass, and these pieces of glass are way over 125 years old. Wow. Yep. I will tell you the, bottom, the bottoms yes. are a little rough. Yes, they have the pontal mm -hmm. on there. Yep. Yeah. I, I filled it with the sunflower. <laughs> <laughs> well, one of these was too rough to do that. This one was okay. Yeah, I've had them too rough also. So this one's got birds with, and some seed dropping. We're going to call that seed. A seed mm -hmm. dropping. <laughs> <laughs> Not bird poo. Bird poo's white. <laughs> Kathy's at 26. Silver's these, at 27. These are very windblown. As you can see, the wind is blowing them around. Yes. Yes, yes. <laughs> That's what you always hate for when you plant sunflower seeds. I, I know there's been a couple years that I can remember. The sunflowers would get really, really high, and then you'd get like a hailstorm or a windstorm. It'll do that to corn and just knock it right over. That's right. Kathy is at 30. I remember one time though, we our our sweet corn got knocked right over and we thought that it was not gonna come back up, but it sure did. Yes. It popped back up. Yeah. It's we, resilient. We do that. Silver's at 32. Peggy and Kathy, let us know. Our high right now is silver. You can see her name underneath Ooh. me, right down there. <laughs> Joel's at 35. <laughs> Linda, you're just too damn close. Move over. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Joel's at 35. You didn't have to elbow me. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Joel's at 35. Peggy, we see your bid, but Joel came in a little higher. And Silver, you're out. So Peggy and um, and uh, Silver, let us know. Kathy's at 36. Kathy is at 36. I see you, Mary, but we have Kathy in there first. Okay, I'm going to do a last chance, and I'm going to just remind everybody where we're at. <clears throat> okay. Mary's at 37. Yeah, it's a good thing, John. There's no room for you in this room, <laughs> even though you got skinny. <laughs> Joel's at 40. So we're waiting for Mary. These look like the same size, are they, Trudy? They the yes, same size? Yes, they are. Um, in fact, these these are the same as what you have, except this one. This one's a blue overlay. This one is not. That's the uh, only difference between my two. Mm -hmm. But this one looks like yours. Yeah. So with white inside. Same, same here. So yeah. Joel is our winner, and Mary is our backup. So you've seen Linda's pretty close. Now, what is the difference between your two, Trudy? This one is blue overlay. Uh -huh. This one is not. This one has a more open crimp. Okay. You can just, and this one has a very tight crimp. I mean, okay. It's the white overlay or blue overlay. Okay. So, Joel, you let us know which ones you want. You either. Okay. So, Joel's going to take Linda's. Okay. Um, and that is 25. 
And he takes the um, Victorian Rose Bowl. And that one is 40. Okay. And so we have Trudy's up. If um, Mary would like it, she is our first backup. If Mary would like one, and then they'll be up for grabs. So um, Trudy has got two of them and they are the, the blue and in, in Trudy's are a little bit deeper blue. Mm -hmm. Um, and her, she's got, she's got bigger sunflowers. Okay. So Mary is going to take Trudy's blue overlay with the tight crimp. So make sure you put Mary's name on it too. Got it right here. Number eight, a. How is this 24? <clears throat> Number. Mm -hmm. Okay, hey, so Mary. the last one is up for grabs if any of anybody wants it. And it is 8B if anybody wants it. Okay. So let's show it to them real close, Trudy. These went for 40, right? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I mean, he was asking. Yep. So we have one left if you'd like it. And this is from the very, very vintage Victorian error glass. And this is a satin glass. And this, this actually came from the glass house in Medina. Um, it's Mary Willett, not Mary Hogue. Oh my gosh, that could have been disastrous. Okay. Thank you, Mary. Thank you for telling me that. Ah, uh, yes. Thank you, guys. This one of Hogan is one that we sold something to. Okay. 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 Does anybody want the last Rose Bowl? It's up for grabs for $40. If you want the last Rose Bowl, it's the Seeds of Hope, and it has the sunflowers on the bottom, and you'll also get the sunflower seeds. Um, Mary Willett gets one. Joel gets one. And there's one more left if you want it. Um, and you just have to claim that piece. Okay. And it's the one on the turntable. Yep, we did. Mary, we're all set. I'm sorry about that. Oh, yes. We got that in the right name. Yep. We have two Marys, okay. huh? Mm -hmm. We do. I did that with Candy last week. I We have Candy Collins and Candy Greathouse, and I got them mixed up, too. I'm just, apparently, uh -oh. I'm just scanning. <laughs> I know. Okay. Last chance on the last Rose Bowl. Uh, Sue Lowe wants it. Sue Lowe. I got that one right. <laughs> Thank you, guys. So put Sue's, put Sue's name on it, Trudy, so she sees we it. We did. All it right. A, B. Okay. Okay. Have, Sorry, have Judy. A... We'll see if we can't get some more. I think we have more Rose Bowls like that. Um, we also have some yellow ones. So we'll try to do some more for maybe our next event in Huron or something. We'll... We'll, yeah, we'll work one. on some more of those. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Let's go ahead and put up, it's getting late. So let's go ahead and put up our paperweights. Now, um, okay. both girls have done iceberg paperweights and we're going to take orders on these and they'll show you the ones that they have done. Um, I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to go ahead and I think I'm going to let Trudy put hers up first, Linda. I'm going to put you down for a second here. Okay. Um, put me down gently. Yeah, I'm going to. <laughs> yes. No, but you last time. <laughs> okay. Okay. So these, these are going to be a set price. And mm -hmm. these are the iceberg paperweights. It does look 3D. And show, Trudy will show you about it here in a second. <clears throat> And these are a set price of 75. Okay. What I did is I painted it like you were looking at a garden of sunflowers. So from each side, oh. you can see sunflowers behind. Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And it's got the signature down here. And then on this side, you have the um, seeds falling down. And so they, they, each side has the full bloom sunflower, like here. And then it has another big 
sunflower. This one has the um, leaves turning downwards because uh, it's mm -hmm. the one that's starting to drop the seeds. And then there is a bud for a new sunflower that hasn't opened up all the way yet. Okay. So this sunflower is meant to be put in a window. And when you put it in a window, you'll yeah. have the beautiful blue sky behind it. And it's going to show off the blue and the yellow, <laughs> which is what we want to get. We, um, so it's just gorgeous. It's $75. Now, um, I don't, are these going to be ready right away or we're taking orders on these? How are we going to do this with invoicing? Okay. I have six that are ready to go and okay. I'm picking up uh, 24 blanks at the end of next week. So uh, Linda and I can split those however the okay. sale goes. Um, so, so, um, Trudy will decide how she invoices you. If she has them available, she'll invoice you. If the, if she doesn't have them done, she'll probably put you on a standby list or something. However, she does that. Um, yes. we'll figure that out, but I'm going to take your, or, your name right now. I um, don't, uh, invoice until it's done. I have one of these spoken for by Salvador and, okay. um, but I, I can go ahead and take but we can so, go ahead and we can go ahead and take names. Not okay. problem. So Peggy Mulford Chitwood takes one. Mark Gibson takes one. Shelly Gibson. They're um they're they're brothers and sisters from another mother. <laughs> 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 Shelly Gibson takes one. Um Debbie V takes one. And that is V E R S L Y U S. No, whatever it is. I said it wrong, but we got I'm it. Sure, Emma got it. Okay. So one, two. Okay. So um, so far we're doing really good, and everybody that got one is going to be able to get one right away. So they are seventy five dollars. And Trudy, can you measure this for us? I can. And Linda's will be the same size. Um, they are at the highest point, five and a quarter inches, and they are six and six and a quarter, quarter inches wide at the widest point. Right. Yes. Both artists have their own design for, for their paperweight. So this is Trudy's design. So you can order these, um, you know, if you're watching this on the Rewind, we would be happy to take your orders, too. Velma Weston um, takes one. And Velma is going to be coming to Huron. So you can ask her if maybe she would want you to bring it. I um, can that's do up to that. Her. That's still a little ways off. But Velma will be with us at Huron. Anybody else on Trudy? So these are very thick paperweights. They're iceberg paperweights. And if you look at it, you'll see it's 3D. It's it's kind of, do they call it reverse painted, Trudy? Uh, that's what I did on these. When you look through, <laughs> I didn't really think about this. So the first color you see, um, I had to put on so that when you look through, you would see the same colors in the centers. I don't know. From, mm -hmm. from front to back. So I had to do reverse painting. And then I had to come back after that fired in. And then I had to come back and put the um, <clears throat> this on again. Uh -huh. The centers. Because the centers had to be reversed. Now the, um, of course, the petals, it didn't matter. But the centers, it did. Okay. Velma said you can bring hers to Huron. She's okay. going to be excited to meet you. Okay. Oh, well, I'm excited to meet everybody. Um, Velma's yes. I take to Huron. Okay, so we are going to show you Linda's now. Um, I've got Peggy, Mark, Shelly, Debbie, and Velma for Trudy's. If you if you, uh, if you you want it, Trudy, Trudy's, just say Trudy's paperweight. We're going to show you Linda's. Um, and then... We'll see how we're doing for the evening. Okay, Linda. This is the front. And I have two that are slightly different from each other. 
but basically the same theme. This one has the reverse painting on the back. It's got a little bit of blue sky on the back, so let me turn it. So this is the back. That's where I put some of the blue sky and the birds. Okay. Thank you. So that's one. Have and Linda's two. is a little different. Her flowers are smaller, and she's focusing on the sky and the birds and the seeds coming down. Where um, Trudy's has the big um, sunflowers. I, I told you they had different styles, and they truly do. And they're both so wonderful. I love each one of these. And this looks like a whole flower garden, Linda. Yeah. This was the first one I did, and I got carried away. <laughs> <laughs> that happens. I know how that goes. Okay. Yeah. So that's the front. And it has blue sky on the front with the birds, which makes it a little bit different than the first one I showed. And then the other side. This is the back. Okay. And it has, so and some blue okay, sky. Okay, so we, we have them different. So you're going to have to write who wants which one. So... Send it, uh, Susan Perry is going to take the second one. This one? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the rest are going to all be the same, right? And the ones in the kiln are all the same. Yeah, there's seven of them. Okay. And how, what, what do the ones in the kiln look like? Yeah, what do they look like? Are they that um, they look more like this one, but this one's got... You know, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> oh, I, I remember I didn't put any orange on the ones in the kiln. Okay. And they have the blue sky on the back, which this one does too. So it's, it's a like in that and then birds on the back. This one, this okay, so other one, the one that Su you said Susan Perry took. Uh -huh. This is the only one that I have the sky on both sides. Okay. And okay, it actually so she's gonna make clouds, a, too. She's gonna, a little bit of clouds. Linda will make the rest of them kind of consistent. They'll kind of be something in between. They're going to have a lot of sunflowers in it, but they're just artists. They're not all going to be the same exact design, but they're going to be very similar. So, okay, yeah. let's see what we have. Susan Perry, um, Kathy G., and Debbie Harper. Susan Perry. Okay. Beautiful works. Uh, uh, Regina says you guys do a wonderful job. Thank you. Linda, will you make another one like the first one you did for Joel? Oh, absolutely. Okay, Joel, you'll get one like the first one. You, you got to keep this at track, Linda. I got Tom wrote it down. Kathy so wants one like that first one, too. Who? Kathy G. Kathy G wants one like the first one? Yep. Okay. You see, when I was doing the first one, I was trying to get my stride and looking mm -hmm. for, you know, what I wanted. And apparently, I wanted everything. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now they're saying number two. So which one did you show number two? Because that's the one everybody wants. Sorry, guys. We'll get this straight here in a second. Okay, the one, one. This is the one that has uh, some white clouds. That's the only difference. Okay, really. that's the one that they're wanting. Okay. Okay. So, you, so I'm going to put white clouds on it. Okay, Susan what number are you giving this? White clouds. Kathy, Kathy G wants one with white clouds. Okay. And Joel wants one with white clouds. Okay. Here okay. we go. Did you get now that? we know. Sorry okay. about that. We should have had that fi figured out before we started, but we got it. Do you okay. Susan Perry want this? Now, Linda, yep. Linda, I will be picking up paperweights uh, probably Thursday or Friday next week. Okay. For Mosser. Okay. So, um, I'm picking up 24, so there'll be plenty to cover the orders. Okay. Get. Okay. Okay. So didn't Sounds Susan cool. Perry want this one? Yep. Yep. Okay. So you have four people that want this one? Okay. Um, Debbie didn't seem to have a choice. 
but so that's good. We're all set. All right. Okay, okay. we got it. I didn't realize they were different. So that that's my fault, but we got it straight. So yeah. does anybody else want one? They are 75. I can post pictures of the ones that are in the kiln tomorrow. Okay. Well, as long as they're similar and they got a little clouds, they, they seem to like the clouds. Okay. So um, Kathy G is also going to take one of Trudy's. So she gets one of both. Okay. Okay. Is that a so C anybody else, a? if you'd like one, let us know. Okay. Um, Sue wants to know if you ladies collect Fenton yourself. Yes. <laughs> What's your favorite I, piece? <laughs> I, love, I love Ruby. You like Ruby? Love Ruby. What do you like, like Trudy? My favorite is Mulberry, but I don't really have a collection. My collection's at my mother's. <laughs> she <laughs> has, I have painted so many things over the years that she has a pretty big collection. And um, yeah, mine did too. So, Every time I it, I paint something for me, then then somebody would need something for a charity to raffle off, you know, like the volunteer fire department or something like that. And I would donate donate pieces that would bring you know a really nice amount of money for their collection. So I ended up with no pieces, but my mom's got a lot, and the collection's coming to me. So yeah. Okay. All right. Anybody else on the paperweights? Anybody else on the paperweights? You're welcome, I, Kathy. We still have these. I know. I think we're going to save those for the next sale because I got some more to send you. Then we'll have more of them at one time. Is that okay? okay. Yep. I have a couple more vases. You do? I do. I didn't realize you did. I do. Would you like to see them? Yes. Okay. Can we do this... choice on them? What, let me see what you've got. Oh, okay. It's getting late, so. We can do All right. choice. Okay. You want to hang with us, Linda? Sure. Okay. I'm proud um, of you. Right. This will be our last lot tonight, then. Okay. Okay. And this will be. This will be number eight. Well, I've got it as number eight, but whatever number you are, Trudy. Number nine. Um, number nine. Um, this one is six and a quarter inches tall. And it is Fenton. Um, and this one is seven and a half inches at its highest point. Now they both, this one has the same uh, painting on all four sides and the top flower is the one that's curling over and has the seeds falling. Okay. So, okay. And then so let this, me just tell everybody this is auction style. So we're going to start yeah. it. Um, 25. Okay. Let everybody have some fun. And then this one um I thought it was going to be blue overlay, but it wasn't. It's just a beautiful baby blue. Um, and it has, uh, if you remember on the um, big bowls, it has the same pattern going. You've got three sets or four sets of this. You've got the uh, big sunflower. Then you have the sunflower that's starting to curl over and dropping seeds. And then you have the shorter one curled over and dropping seeds. Okay. Okay. And that repeats itself four times going around the vase. Same way with oh, this. We're losing one. you, Trudy. Oh, I'm sorry. You got me now. There you go. Okay. Yeah, we're just for some reason we're losing you. Um. Well, you know, I'm doing my vanishing act. What can I say? <laughs> there uh, she goes. Maybe it's just on my end. And my, I, I see you the only one here. I don't know. I saw uh, you the whole time. I, I can see me the whole time. Okay. It's probably I, just on my end then. Okay. Now, I'm not like the ghost that lives here and disappear here and there and then show up somewhere else in the house. I have a question. 
I yeah. got this green thing going over my uh, Chrome figure. I don't know if it's doing an update. It's doing something. <laughs> okay. My question so we'll is. Bear with it. I have no idea what it's doing. Is that peaking blue? All right. Donna Taylor's in at 27. This one? Yeah. I think so. Okay. It has kind of a grayer tone to it. Mm, it's pretty. I really liked it. I like pink, peaking blue. I can't say it now. Right, don't ask me. I wouldn't be able to say it. I get it all tongue tied. Uh, <laughs> they have at, okay at the craft stores in Joanne Fabrics. They have silk, smaller silk sunflowers. That would mm -hmm. be really pretty, pretty in these. Yeah. So the handkerchief vase there is a Fenton vase, and that is like a slag. And it has the raised mm -hmm. roses around the bottom. And ah. that is a Fenton vase. It has the flower base. Is you the other see. is the other vase Fenton or is that just um an uh no it's do we know anything about that vase? It's got the stamp right here. Mm. Okay, Fenton. so they're both Fenton vases. Okay. Yes, they are. And I know this one's Fenton, I just can't see it, but let me see if I can get it up here where you can see the slag. Uh, let me try this. The slag is mostly right over top of the roses that are on here. So if you can imagine, you've got your rose garden and then you've got your sunflower garden behind the rose garden. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. I can do it. Well, that's where my brain went when, when I first saw this. <clears throat> Nancy's at 45. I think I bought a bud vase like that from uh, Denise when she came on with you, Rosie. Uh -huh. It was not like that with the white. Yeah, uh, I... Yeah. I didn't even think of that vase as something we could use, but it's very pretty. At first, well, as soon as you showed so it. I hope that everything's coming through okay. My system is yeah. updating. I don't know why it's doing it now, but it is. So it's, I'm it's just fine on it's this okay. One. It's good here. Okay. Like, who bought it? No, no. Is your picture clear? Yeah, Emily's Chase picture's at clear. Emily's picture's clear on her laptop, Heidi. See everything. Yeah, it's me. I can. I've got a green light just going back and forth over my Chrome. Something is going on where it's it's updating. But if as long uh -huh. as it's okay on your end. Yes, it Vicky is. Martin is at fifty. The only thing I'm seeing is your voice um, was broken yeah, a couple times. Probably when I looked down. No, it seemed like it was a signal thing. Ah, okay. But it didn't go for very long. That's good. Okay, so we're, we still have active bidding, so I'm just taking the bids. All right, 54 with Nancy Shea. Uh, Jamie, I see you're, you're right in there, but Nancy Shea beat you. John is out. John was bidding on that one, too. John loves sunflowers. He has a whole acre garden that he puts sunflowers in every year. Wow, oh, wow. that's great. Yes, oh, we just picture. love to watch them because sunflowers. the heads will follow the sun. And um, it's really yeah. cool. And then all the birds come in, and it's just wonderful. Yeah. I want to see a picture this summer. Yes. Okay. Me, too. We will do uh, that. Sunflowers are Nikki's favorite flower as well. Nancy Shay's at 58. Vicki Martin's at 60. I have trouble growing them, actually. I plant them you every have year. trouble growing them? Yes, I do. It, well, it, it's the thorn in my side. I well, Linda, don't feel bad. I've planted them here, and they just don't come up. I don't think they like my soil. Oh, maybe but that's it. The soil, the soil here is really bad. Um, my flower beds, I've added soil, 
<clears throat> yeah, I have to amend everything I plant. Everything I plant gets new dirt. Of course, my the the H hounds have destroyed the back flower beds. They are no more. <laughs> oh, that's painful. <laughs> it is painful. <laughs> they thought we put those there. Okay. Jamie's at sixty-two. We're just waiting for Vicki Martin. So Jamie's at 62. We're waiting for Vicki Martin. We've already done a last chance. So Vicki Martin, let us know. Bidder will get choice. We still have active bidding at 63. If I can click it. There we go. John says, a fun auction. We love Trudy and Linda and the great pieces. Yes. Vicky's at <laughs> 63. You. We're waiting for Jamie. I didn't realize that one, that, that one must be peak, uh, the Peking Blue. Yeah, this one. <laughs> yeah, you said it. I know. I heard you. <laughs> I love the Peking Blue. Yes. <laughs> 65 with Jamie. Vicki Martin, let us know. I got some candlesticks out of Peking Blue recently. Oh, yeah? Yeah, and it came with a little bowl. It's beautiful. Sounds like it. I love it. Okay. So Jamie Marsh is our first winner, and Vicki Martin will be our backup. So let us know, Jamie. The handkerchief vase or the Peking blue? Oh, so now I'm all updated and everything is, looks good. All right. <laughs> now you, you ladies are beautiful. Look at you. <laughs> okay, so Jamie takes the Peking blue. Okay, that'll be 9A. And uh, Vicki Martin, would you like the handkerchief vase? So Vicki Martin, you you can have the handkerchief vase if you like it. If not, we'll put it up for grabs, or we'll put it. We'll take it to here, and we'll do something. We'll do something. Always something will happen. Yeah. <laughs> We're just waiting for Vicki Martin before we put it up for grabs. Let's see what she says. Vicki Martin's going to take that one. Vicki Martin one, gets the handkerchief face. And that will be 9B. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All okay. right. I'm going to okay. squeeze in here with you guys. Okay. <laughs> I'll get my shoulders pinched up. <laughs> I'm so excited for you guys. What a wonderful job our artists did tonight. What a wonderful job you guys did showing up and, and uh, participating in the sale. We are so thank excited. You. Yes. Thank you very, very much. We appreciate it. We're going to work real hard at these pieces. One more time. Remember, Trudy invoices, Trudy and M. They invoice all their stuff. I invoice for Linda um, and uh, the Bears that uh, we sold last week, you should you should get by this time next week. And we'll move on here with this order just as soon as we can get it. Most of the stuff, well, well, it's just a matter of invoicing is, is basically what it is. So um, if you want any of the pieces that were unsold tonight, please just comment in the um, section below if you're on YouTube, or you can comment on either one of the Facebook pages if you want a paperweight or um, a bear. Or sure. if there was something that didn't sell tonight, which I don't know if there was, but we are birds. so excited that you came and supported us. Remember, we are giving part of the proceeds to UNICEF, and we will continue this project probably through Marietta at least. Um, reminds you of a backseat in a station wagon. Yes, we are all very <laughs> close here. <laughs> okay, so um, our, on the agenda is the 10 at 10 tomorrow morning. Both of our ladies are going to have their general sale here. Um, we haven't discussed a date, but it's going to be very, it'll be within the next month. We'll have, we'll both have general sales. The bears are 75, Donna. Would you like to see them? 
I don't know if you uh, would like to see them real quick before we leave, but there is one. Um, and they are 75. They come with a uh, pack of sunflower seeds and um, they are just beautiful. They we, they we call them snow bears, but we've made them seeds of hope bears because they're they're so pretty. They're um, they, they almost glow. So if you want. They do the work. birds, we don't have the birds yet. Yeah, the birds, were, we, we are working on getting long-tailed crystal birds or crystal satin birds, if you know anybody that has any. I um, have two birds. Oh, you want to see, uh, oh, maybe you want to see Trudy birds. Trudy's birds. Yes, those are Trudy's birds, and they were 85. And I have two. Okay, yep, there's two of those. We should have put them all in a group, and I didn't realize that we had... Um, we could have done that. So we'll, we'll put the birds up again next time if nobody wants them. If you want them oh, this time, you can just claim them. Okay. All right. Ladies, can you stay in the house while I close the sale? I want to talk to you for just a mm -hmm. second. Um, sure. We're going to say goodbye, everybody. Um, and we're going to end the broadcast. And I will we'll see you very soon. And I'll see you tomorrow <laughs> at 10 at 10. We got a good selection. See you later. Thank you, everyone. Ladies, stay with me here just a second.